By now, you've probably seen the images of all that plastic trash floating in our oceans. Well, scientists say the problem is only going to get worse. According to the United Nations, if things don't change, by the year 2050, there will be more plastic in our oceans than fish. So you know what Easter is. And it's for that reason Reverend Joshua Kingsley is encouraging his church members to give up plastic for the 40 days of Lent. Uh, the purpose of the season is to look in the mirror and to look at adapting our life. The challenge is called Plastic Free Pilgrimage to Earth Day. Each day of Lent, participants are encouraged to give up a specific plastic item they would normally use. What kind of straws are we using? How are we storing our food? For example, today, participants are encouraged to give up single-use plastic bottles. Yeah, we have reusable water bottles as opposed to as opposed to disposable water bottles. Another day, they're encouraged to use reusable bags. Or there's the Ditch the Plastic Utensils Day. So there's an example of uh, cutlery that is made from a renewable resource. The first United Methodist Church modeled its 40-day calendar after a similar plastic-free Lent challenge done by the Church of England last year. And what started as a small endeavor has quickly grown. And then the next thing you know, there's probably like five or six different organizations and people kind of keep hopping onto it from as far north as Bellingham and as far south as Ashland. But because the world produces about 300 million tons of plastic every year, avoiding it is not easy. I'd be surprised if very many people get like an A-plus on this thing. But that is part of this pilgrimage. You know, it's a chance to confront the ways that it's time to change. You know, some of the, the church points out anyone can take part in it, even those who don't traditionally observe Lent, like Leslie, who already jumped ahead to day 29 by buying a secondhand backpack. So I'm going to be reusing it, right? I'm going to be, instead of buying a new one, I'm using this. And for those who do observe Lent, like Bob. Before this year, I would give up alcohol. This year gives them a chance to try something new, not just to help themselves, but also to help our planet. I won't get everything done and I won't do everything all the time, but I think I will change in a dramatic way how I consume plastics. In Southwest Portland, Keeley Chalmers, KGW News.